Good afternoon everybody, how are we all doing? It is um, Tuesday and if you're new to this channel, I, my name is Kathy and I'm into doing videos on fibro, um, what do you call it, mental health, my furry babies and also new to this is my paranormal and spirit readings. Um, I'll probably do spirit readings if I can when I'm on a live, that's when I start picking up people. Anyway, let's sit back and relax and let's get into it. So we've got a naughty doggy here. Yeah, he wants to eat something. But she's not allowed. Are you uh, Raina? Raina! He will clock your face. Yes, that's what I thought. There's Raina, Ronnie in the cage, and there's Sooty Boo there. Can you see him? And there's a naughty doggy. And this doggy answers back. Raina is a naughty girl. Sometimes. Sometimes she's okay. I'll give her the benefit of the doubt. <laughs> she's the son's dog. Oh, crying out loud. What a second guy. Every time I try and do a video, son rings me. And this doggy do. I'm trying to wolf back away from cat. Raina. Lay down. Good girl. So, I've just sat watching a programme on, I ain't got a clue what channel it is in. Raina, pack it in. Uh, oh yeah, channel five, because I can see the five in the corner. And it's called The Hospital Life on the Line. Now, I like watching stuff like that, I'm like intrigued. And you, whoever, excuse me, mate. It's Doggy Doo, he's doing my head now, knitting. So, about, oh my God. This was a while back now. Um, I said more than seven years actually. I think it. Raina, come on. Pack it in or you go back to bed. That's also got my life. Um, so I'd say about 2016. Yeah, who remembers the secret life of the hospital bed? Mm -hmm. I was on it with Olivia. Oh. I felt so. I looked at me after afterwards. I'm like, oh my god, look at state of me, you know, because I was stressed. Raina, I was stressed with the day that was because she was due to go for an operation that day. Come on, Raina, what's the guys? Sorry, I just put back in with Tom um, because oh, she just bought me the cattle on. Um, I'm getting one of those. Oh, you know, you get like a little lump in your eye, what the cause dies, dies, or something. I can feel it, and it's like, it's like I've got a grain of salt or, or sand in my eye. Anyway, so, yeah, I've been on TV, and I'm looking, <laughs> I looked at myself, I thought, oh my God, look at that big fat tire I have around me. Um, but then I, I obviously, with the nerves, I, I get, I got a dry mouth, so I'm trying to talk. But I'm doing that at the same trying to get <laughs> get my tongue around my mouth, you know, as I'm trying to talk as well. Every time I try to talk, my mouth just like dried up. It was probably I'm feeling anxious because I've never done it like that before, you know what I mean? It's just some Yeah, talking about Olivia and her illness. I know I said it then and I thought better not. That would be for a major operation in 2017. Whoa, 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 so what do you think you're playing at? You just peed on your brother. Move out the road. Um, one second, I forgot where I was now because I just had to put Sutty in with Hannah. Ah, it's gone now, honey. Right, also, yeah, it was on the secret life of the hospital bed. And I wish I'd, if I'd known the cameras would have been there that day. Because you know, you turn up and obviously on a morning when they're doing the pre op, not pre op, is it pre op? No, that's a few days before. They, you just sit there and they'll get your notes together and you tell me what time you're going down or in case there's an emergency blah blah, blah. and uh, I got approached by one of the uh, thingy uh, work camera crew 
And I was like, oh, okay. So I agreed to it, but I didn't. And then I thought, oh my God, what have I done? I'm like, oh, <laughs> yeah. And they're actually I was quite shocked. And I can't remember telling Olivia because they just, you know when they do that? Is it pre-op? And they say, have you got your wobbly teeth? No. Just as she's about to go to that surgery, her tooth fell out. I'm like, you just told me he had no wobbly teeth. Oh my God. So Tooth Fairy came to as well in hospital. And it was so cute because they give you these like, uh, Raina, stop, he's gone. I've put him in with Hannah. Um, they give you this little uh, card in an envelope with a, a little something, a little thingy to put your tooth in so you can tooth fairy can come at home and also tooth fairy care in as well. Um, yeah, so yeah, I've been on TV before. What are you doing, crazy? You're crazy, doggy. Oh my God, this dog's... You know when people flip up M&Ms and catch them in the mouth? What the heck are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you know, why do dogs do that? Does anyone else's dog? Millie does it. This one does it. Grabs the mouth of uh, dog food, takes it over to somewhere else, like aka the sofa, drops it out of the mouth, and then you end up with a wet backside when you sit down. My crazy animals. Even cats do it. Well, so he does it. So yeah, uh, that's a little bit of information you didn't know about me and I was going to say something to, to you guys as well and I cannot for life remember. Uh, yeah, apart from my eye hurting, I'm pretty tired. Uh, I didn't get enough time to make an appointment. Oh, that was it for the doctors because I need to see the doctor. Uh, update on Ronnie. Ronnie boy, my little fluff bum. I can't show you him because Rainer all just want me. Look at this lazy dog. You're pinching Millie's food. Caught you in the act then, didn't I? You might as well eat it now, you got your head in there. Hook date on Ronnie, we've got the vets tomorrow off, so I can give you more of a hook date, but it slowly keeps coming out and it's not a, not meowing as much, he's, like he's in pain. It's just had some tuna, so his output count, there's pain relief. Uh, his tail though, oh, I can't even show you because it's grim. So when it first came home, you could see Obviously, the t top of the tail that attached to his spine, he's still got a bit of sensitivity there. But I think lower, halfway down where the scratch died, all the way down with a bit of firmness in, he's licked it that much. He's bald. It's... I can't. I'm just thought of his turn my stomach. Bless him. I feel sorry for him. And I thought, I did think about putting a bandage around it but then I thought is he going to lick that and just try to eat the bandage so I'll just see what the vets say to me I guarantee the vets are going to say I'm going to it and I feel sorry for him and I feel like he's depressed as well Raina hey, excuse me no 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 we do not behave like that no 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 try to attack the cat bed he's not in it anyway so that's a bit of update on Ronnie boy and yeah, I forgot what I was going to say. I'm going to go and I'll catch you in the next video, guys, because I think I've just been babbling, babbling, babbling. Thank you, Lynn, as well. Much appreciated. I saw your comments this morning. We're half asleep when I saw it, so I'm going to go back and reread it. <laughs> so if I don't make sense, you probably know why, because I didn't get up till late. And you know when you try to, you're like, oh, I've got a message. <laughs> Because it pings straight, pings straight away when I get a message. But on a night, I turn the volume down and everything, apart from the sleep sounds of YouTube. Uh, sorry, I kind of like started breathing. I swallowed a little bit, a bit of air. So I'm going to go back and read it properly because I didn't have my glasses on and all like trying to hurt. <laughs> but thank you anyway. With what I've read, I'm thankful for the uh, great messages. It means a lot. And hopefully you'll be able to join me on my next live, which it will not be this weekend. It'll be the following weekend, but I'll probably have to put a reminder on my calendar because, yeah, I've got a bit of brain fog today. And I luckily got to the petrol station just as my, well, my light was on and it's never been like that. Uh, 
to the point where I'm like panicking, am I going to get to the station in time? Anyway guys, I'm bubbling on again. Yeah, don't forget to hit that like button. And the subscribe button as well because it helps push out my videos in the health room. I can never say that word, it's too posh for me. And press the notification bell and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye, enjoy the rest of your day.